This is CNC 12. In dark mode now like everything on my computers. I use OBS. Studio. Freeware for screen recording. The best freeware I have found for this purpose. CNC 12. In default colors. I like the default colors also. Easy to read and a harmonic composition. But, I want it to be darker. CNC 12. Is highly customizable. For colors you have the color picker. With pre-configured color schemes built in. I have already made a custom one. If you change the color scheme, CNC 12 needs a restart. The VCP is also customized. I have a button to turn the C axis on or off and other changes. Now let's look how the new colors are looking in different screens. The manual can be viewed from CNC 12. I use Foxit. PDF Reader. For me it is a better choice than Acrobat DC. And it also comes with a dark mode. The new manuals are made easy to navigate. With loads of links in there. to change color on particular items. You have different ways. I usually copy color codes from existing colors. But you also can define new colors. It is a good idea to save changes in a new scheme. So, it is easy to go back. If the change is not okay, I do not like this change, so I will go back to the previous version. But it shows you how to modify. Or make your own custom color scheme.
also new in CNC 12, is that now you can dial in feed and rapid override. It is no longer connected in one function. I like this very much because only slowing down rapids makes setting up new parts a lot faster. Another customization I have made is a select tool and go to X button. This loads a tool with its offset in the CNC and drives it to the dialed in position in X. To edit G-code CNC12 uses Notepad++. I have set this also to dark mode, and made new user-defined languages for CNC and PLC editing, which are highlighting functions for easy programming. I use a plugin called Compare Plus for editing the PLC. This makes it easy to find your changes or compare a new PLC to an old one. The PLC can be compiled in Notepad++ with F6. It will be loaded in the motion controller after a power cycle. This here is the XML file of the VCP skin, also easy to modify to your taste and very well documented in the manual. That's it for now, I hope this could give you an overlook how easy it is to modify CNC12 to your taste.